welcome back to our decking series. Thanks, Jim. Hey. This one I was hoping we could touch on <laughs> in the build process, the benefits of having quality framing lumber products, pressure treated framing lumber products, and how maybe that makes the, the build pro process go a little easier for either a homeowner or a deck builder. Definitely. Yeah. Um, being in the industry as long as, as I've been in the industry and, and buying lumber in a variety of places over the years, mm -hmm. I can tell you there is a marked difference when you start going, and you know the grades of lumber better than I do, but you, know, you can buy lumber at, at different grades. And I know what done lumber supplies is, is a very nice quality material. And one of the reasons I mean, Dunlumber isn't the cheapest lumber yard in town, sure. but let me tell you, the material that comes out of Dunlumber is is top notch, and I know I can count on it, and I know you guys back it. Yeah. So, from a building point of view, when if you're working with good quality framing lumber, we talked a lot about how you leveling out a deck and, yeah. and getting all the tops of those joists yeah. for synthetic decks so they're they're as flush as possible and yeah. knocking crowns down so you don't yeah. have any humps at all. Uh, is way easier if you're buying a good quality framework. When you buy sub-quality, you're going to have all those issues that I'm talking about are, are expanded. They're they're yeah. just worse. This selection of lumber that ends up going back to the lumber yard much greater because you just mm -hmm. can't use it. There's there's a point where you go, I can't use this board. I just got to replace it. And and the percentage goes way up when you're using a subpar framework. So yeah. uh, I think that the quality of materials throughout any project play a role in your finished product, but but it all starts for me with the framing package. So that's yeah. as crucial as it gets. Yeah, um, I'm glad you touched on that. Uh, we actually did a, a, a segment, video segment with Dennis McWhorter of Exterior Wood where we focused on the premium grade all-purpose construction lumber, framing lumber that we sell. And uh, hearing him spell it out, just by their, their standard way of doing business, they already pull out some coals, but then what they do to make this grade they're pulling out another five, six, seven, eight, nine percent. Uh, I'm also glad that we touched on it too, because one of the tough things, like say, you know, Dunlumber, we're not the low price supplier. We don't want to be, we never will be. And there's reasons for that. But when somebody slides a, a decking bid, a manufactured decking project <laughs> bid across the table, and it's got, you know, manufactured decking, and it's got Simpson hangers, and it's got concrete and all these things, and, and the treated lumber, and well, shoot. It's, it's apples to apples. Well, when it comes to the treated lumber, that's where it's apples to oranges in our situation. So, and honestly, it probably costs us 15 to 20% more just to buy that product. And hopefully we'll continue to be able to buy it. So I'm glad you could touch on that. Well, having framed a few decks out of lumber that wasn't up to your standards, uh, <laughs> uh, we I came screaming back to Dun Lumber just for that reason. Uh, there, there are certain you know job sites outside of where you guys yeah. go, and and so you get whatever the locals have, and uh, yeah, it's you can definitely tell the difference when you start working with something less than you're used to. Yeah. All of a sudden, the appreciation for for consistent, consistent good quality lumber is is uh, key. I think. Well, you know, when you're a professional and you guys are trying to produce jobs and keep on the schedule and a rhythm. Uh, you talked about a lot of the prep that needs to be done and you know, if somebody's going to resurface a deck and so forth. So you might, I'm assuming you might have a lot more additional prep work if you're dealing with a, a lesser quality material. Ton of prep work. Time I mean, is money. It, it, yeah. I mean, you know, pick your poison on that. It could be just the, the, the time it takes to pick out and, and cull through all that and use the the good stuff and return the old stuff. And, and then you're going to have issues possibly with your homeowner going, why is that board in there? You know, yeah. even though it makes code right. and it's, there's nothing structurally wrong with it. It just doesn't yeah. look as nice. Yeah. Uh, so there are a lot of things that you end up dealing with. So when you start thinking about what you're saving, yeah. you know, you add it up. It's, yeah. it, it, I think it turns over pretty darn quick, at least in my opinion. Yeah. Well, I appreciate you giving us some feedback on that. You know, uh, yeah, it, it makes sense for us. We're always focused on a quality product, and hopefully, fingers crossed, we're going to be able to keep providing that <laughs> that upgraded, treated product for our for our clients. And we're going to hold you to that. All right. <laughs> Thanks for sharing. Thank you.